Okay, I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Getting much coverage. I should look for more towers to activate. All units, escaped prisoners are stealing food from a supply station. Please mobilize on Museum Mile. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Off limits, ma'am. I left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. Sorry, ma'am. Security room's off limits. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right Security now. Security room's it's open. Just, just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Wear your way out of here. We're in charge now. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Patrolling sector, status clear. multi-million dollar building with network speeds from 1990. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around.
Huh? Who's there? Putting a sweep. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Watch your sixes, men. Norman and Sable. Wait! Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable. Right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire it. Useless button. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The fabulous Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No phones found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just 
wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room, but it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto: "Pax in bello, peace in war." <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here! The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Huh? Who's there? Control. I heard something. Running a sweep. Standing down, Control. False alarm. 
Standing down, Control. False alarm. Stay alert. I think we got company. Stay alert. I think we got company. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Mormon's got a real mad scientist thing going on. these things prototype hand grenades wow norman wins the fancy map contest looks like norman's tracking dr michael's movements creep fest mm, kind of makes sense huh this shows all of oscorp's properties had no idea they owned so sable troop deployments <sighs> they're stationed all over the city I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michaels' path. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Norman Osborne, GR-27. A child's x-ray. But it's not Harry or Emily. Who is this? That aura around him. Is this Martin Lee? Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Hmm, looks wrong. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Don't think I've chosen the right categories.
AR interface. <laughs> Very slick. Bravo, bravo, bravo. Dr. Strom. Isn't he a rope? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Commercial buildings. Wow. Some Oscorp's going on. No. A records facility could be perfect cup. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath lab must. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building. But there's no security detail. This Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's look. Nice. Got some overlap with Dr. Michael's path. This is so cool. Like that movie about future crime? I didn't kill my wife! Wait a minute. Wait, no, that's the wrong movie. This thing needs more sound effects. Boop. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Oscorp's going all in. Hmm, looks wrong. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Nope, that's just a Sable Patrol. No, Dr. Michaels was near a lot of Sable forces, but it's not an Oscorp facility. Good old Alpha Team. None of these patrols cross Dr. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable- Nice! Got some overlap with Dr. Michaels' path. No. A records facility could be perp GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it! Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it! Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. No! Who's there? We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two 
two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Alpha team, stay alert. Something control. Stand by. Control. I heard something. Running a sweep. Cancel that control. Sector clear. Something control. Stand by.
Sector clear. Continuing patrol. Look alive. We've got company. to clear that balcony. Alpha team, stay alert. You're amazing. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon. I promise. Now, after years, literally didn't see that coming. 
these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti-serum.
Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. I'm tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Sable would cut me some slack. We should be on the same team. Sable it down. Easier to take these guys out if they're split up. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. Oh. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh. Oh. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast.
way to go but down. Sample. You, Martin! Don't let revenge win. Fight it! Demon! 
Aston Martin. Beat the demon? I am the demon! This is the wrong way, Martin. Bad 
look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? I would not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. It's not it. Maybe it's this one. No.
built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. Change this number. I must leave New York. Recent events give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Dang! I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. I question our work. They do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. Did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. With a little creation of my own. the truth. 
before they mop you off the pavement. No! Oh! Tell them what you did. I never. Oh! Everything you have is built on lies. Lies! Ah! Oh! <laughs> You stole my company, my ideas! Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me! The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you! You're a failure, Otto! And you always will be! Otto, you've worked your whole life to help you. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But have it your way. We don't have much time! Please! I'll turn over the anti serum when Osborne pays for his crime! You've already done enough to ruin our board! No! He always bounces! <laughs> he has to lose everything! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
such a disappointment. Parker. You knew? I tried to warn you, Peter. But you didn't listen! You knew! I won't let you win! This means too much to me! Not more than it means to me! To change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more. saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me, just like all the others. Turn? Turn? I've worshipped you, your mind, your conscience, wanting to help others, the way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty, a responsibility. To use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best for those beneath us. Whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh. I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. 
do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms! I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter? Still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes. gonna be okay ma'am I've got the cure right here take off your mask I want to see my nephew you knew I've known for a while I never wanted you to worry I did and I am so proud of you and Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do.
So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. <laughs> Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. Uh, I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete? Yeah? I, uh, kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh. Uh. Well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. Not that. Uh. I think it's, I think it's better that I just, um. I show you. I show no, you. No, 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 no. <laughs> 
pretty weird, right? Not that weird. So close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. 